Love getting you guys involved at home, getting on Twitter using the hashtag 7 Sports Cave. Mike Foss, sports producer extraordinaire, getting ready for that Monday night football show tomorrow night. Mike, you've been on Twitter, though, checking things out for us in the control room. What's up, bud? Yeah, we're very excited for tomorrow. 7 o'clock right here on 7. We'll get you ready for kickoff between the Lions and the Seahawks. Let's jump into what the people are saying on Twitter. Jeff talking about Michigan State. As a Spartan fan watching MSU games, something doesn't feel right. Uh, they need a big step up when playing in Ann Arbor in two weeks. Bob says, wow, Michigan's defense the past two weeks has been amazing. It's like they've formed a bleeping wall. Ah. Sincerely, Stan Van Gundy. <laughs> Henry says, feels good seeing fellow EMU Eagle Ron Rice. Hey, we did all right against LSU. Yes, they did. Yeah. You can't stop the action. And Isaac saying, uh, talking about the Lions, 0-3 on the coaching, but also on Mayhew. No reason to lose both Fairley and Sue. Questionable drafting the last few years. Guys? Uh Coaching and, and front office, really, the last part of that there. I mean, look, the Lions had a lot of built-up hype coming into this year. I mean, why ha what, and when you have to explain to people why they've dropped the ball, what do you say? I mean, you know, everything has to, everything has to work together. You know, from top down, from Martin and, and, and Tom to Jim Caldwell and the players. If everything is not clicking, it just doesn't work. But on the field, if you don't protect your quarterback, if your quarterback can't hit the mark, and the game is designed for the pass, then you're not going to be successful. Real quick, Michigan State, Michigan, if you had to pick that game today, even though it's in two weeks, who you got? Spartans. I love that pick. No bias here. The quarterback. <laughs> when in doubt, go with the QB. <laughs> All right, coming up next, we reveal the nominees for our Leo's Coney Island High School Game of the Week. That's coming up next on the Suburban Ford 7 Sports Game. <laughs>